Okay, today we're going to uh, replace the caps in here. Yay! Um, but first, I'm going to uh, hook up a ground here and just discharge, just in case there's any residual charge in there. Alright, now I'm going to uh, label each one of these, so after I get those labeled, I'll be right back. Okay, the wires are all labeled. Let's see if these come out very good. Okay, we're just going to do that to the rest of them. Alright, as you can see, it's been dewired. So, I'm going to flip it over and see if we can get this can out. Hopefully, it'll come off easy. Before we take the can off, I thought I'd show you this. This is the uh, label. Looks like it's been uh, riveted to one of the IF cans. Isn't that kind of neat? Philco Radio, Nutridyne Plus, Model 86, Volts 115, Cycles 50 to 60, Watts 70. Made in USA by Philadelphia Storage Battery Company, Philadelphia, PA. Let's see if we can get a little bit closer in there. Isn't that cool? Awesome! Okay, off with the can. Okay. All right. This is what we're going to take out here. See that pencil tap? I love that. I learned that from John from Arkansas. This is John. So this is what we're going to take out. Here's some places to pry it loose. It's not that heavy. Some more places. Let's see if we can read that here. It says Dublier Condenser Corporation, January 13th, 1929. Ah, cool. It's been in there a long time. All right, let me uh, get the chassis off, and we'll come back, and we'll see if we can get this off. I'll be right back. Okay. Let's see if this comes. Oh, it's coming off easy. see the tar in there. Are we having fun yet? wires in there. I already cracked it. Damn it. At least I won't show.
I'm just gonna have to uh, break that up. I'll have to make a. It's pretty brittle anyway. I can make one of those. Chop chop. That's another one of John's from Arkansas sayings. Chop chop. Chop chop time. He loves to chop. Let's save these. Maybe I'll boil this. Huh? And see if that works. Honey, guess what's for dinner? Okay. Boil that a little while, and then we'll see what happens, and then we'll get right back with it. Well, it's really going crazy here. Hope I don't explode. I'm going to turn down a little bit. Well, it's been boiling about five minutes when I turned it back around here. Looks like it's softened up quite a bit. Here you can see it's softened it up. This, on the side it goes all the way through there. Yeah. Now I got a cooking video and a repair video all in one here. Put some salt and pepper in it. Well, I'm going to get ready. I'm going to spread some newspaper on my bench. And we'll bring it in there and see how much of that we can get out. Stay tuned. Well, there it is. Mmm, just like mom used to make. Let's see if we can get it out of there. Man, I can use this uh, leftover water for some spaghetti tonight. What do you think? No! Let me get rid of that. And we'll, co we'll continue with the detarring. I'm not looking forward to this. I need something better to do that out with. Oh, there's technical difficulties. I didn't have my mic on. So you can probably see there's some looks like there's some foil and that's the big nothing but a big cap. If I just get this, hey, there it goes. I get to 
do more chop chop. Gotta get a good look at that. A massive foil paper. Oh boy. Fun part of this job. When it's all done, you can look back and say, Wow, I did all that. And I took that tar out. A smart guy would have just added some caps on the bottom, but no, I wanted to restuff it. clean up some of this mess. Maybe I'll take a heat gun to it. We'll be right back. I'll be back. I'll be back. Well, I'm back. I got some gloves on. Looks like I'm losing my paint here. I figured that would come off anyway. Alright. I got one of these Harbor Freight heat guns. See what happens. No cut, no glory. The smell of tar in the morning. Hell yeah! Cool. 
Yeah, you can say that again. That's a separator. Ah. Somebody had stuck a hundred dollar bill in here. Wouldn't that be cool to find that? Well, have you seen enough of this mess? <sighs> of this out. Probably use some lacquer thinner. Clean that up. Clean this mess up. What a mess! And uh, we'll, we'll show, show you what it looks like after I do all that. So, hope you enjoyed that, because I sure didn't.